Bayern Munich launch a team photo each year to celebrate the culture of their people, a culture that's embraced and celebrated across the world. We know it as Oktoberfest, and it gives beer lovers everywhere the chance to enjoy great German beer. But this year's photo has a subtle difference. Here's why. As part of a commercial partnership that Bayern has with famous local brewery Polliner, each year before the club embarks on its preseason tour, the club poses for a new season team photo. Now we know what you're thinking. Every club in the world poses for a new season team photo. Why is this so special? Well, not every team poses for their annual photo dressed fully in lederhosen and holding a beer. But based in the heart of Bavaria, that's exactly what Bayern Munich do. However, this year's photograph had a couple of subtle details that were picked up when the picture was released on social media. Eagle-eyed fans were quick to point out that superstar summer signing from Liverpool, Sadio Mane, was not, in fact, holding a beer. Along with fellow new signing, Nusser Masraoui, Mane is all smiles as he's dressed head to toe in the customary local attire, but is notably not holding a beer like his thirsty teammates. This was not a protest at the brewery or Mane's dislike for that particular brew. In actual fact, the decision not to hold the beer is down to Mane and Masraoui's religious beliefs. Both players are devout Muslims, and the consumption of alcohol is forbidden in Islam. Mane and his new teammate, Masraoui, were both commended and praised online as the photo began to circulate, with the Muslim community delighted to see such a high-profile figure publicly practicing the teachings and beliefs of Islam. It should be noted that although both players chose not to be pictured with the beer, they had no problem at all in dressing the part and were very much in the spirit of things. Incidentally, it should be noted that this isn't the first time we've seen Mane showcase his beliefs and disciplines in his football career. When Liverpool won the Carabao Cup at Wembley in February, the customary on-pitch celebration followed the victory amongst the players on the pitch. As they danced on the pitch and posed for celebrations and photos, Mane's teammate Takumi Minamino grabbed a nearby bottle of champagne and was ready to spray the bottle's contents as part of the jubilant scenes. However, as Minamino was standing next to Mane, he respectfully looked at him for the OK. A shake of the head from Mane appeared to suggest Minamino shouldn't do it so near to him in another show of commitment to his religion. Mane politely suggested he put the bottle down and his teammate respectfully obliged as the celebrations continued. Later, Mane and Salah raced for cover as champagne was gleefully sprayed amongst the players. Mane is keen to immerse himself in Bavarian culture and impress his new fans. If he continues the form he showed at Liverpool that made him one of the most lethal forwards in world football, we don't think he'll have any problems winning over the Bavarian faithful. All signs suggest that he'll be a huge fan favorite following a strong start to life in the Bundesliga. He even took to the stands with a megaphone to celebrate with the fans after scoring on his debut in a 6-1 win over Eintracht Frankfurt. That's the sort of thing that is sure to place Mane in the hearts of the club's fans. Sadio Mane is known to be one of the most humble and down-to-earth footballers in the world. He prays five times a day and regularly gives back to the community as well as huge charitable donations. I think a player of his quality and ability doesn't need to hold a beer to win over the fans. His general character and performances on the pitch are already more than enough. If you enjoyed this video, why not check out 8 Things You Didn't Know About Sadio Mane?